Okay, here we have a problem. This shaft is pretty much trashed. Uh, the bushing that was used with it is also trashed. It went right through the bushing into the uh, bracket that supported the bushing and it's damaged the shaft. Now normally if I had a good shaft I would use a bronze bushing. They're cheap and they work pretty good. One kind of like this. Okay, this is a kind of an El Cheapo residential sort of thing. Uh, but the bronze bearing material must run on a clean shaft. If I put it on a trash shaft like that, I got problems. So, what do I do? Well, instead of using the bronze bushing, I will use a ball bearing. The ball bearing has this inner tubing, and it does not require a smooth shaft. It has to be reasonably concentric, but uh, because the bearing is not here, the bearing is up in here. So I take this thing, stick it on there like that. Now I probably don't want to put it right exactly there. I want to be somewhat off of that, so I may have to move that shaft a little bit uh, to get it to work properly. But I have two set screws on this uh, right there, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to tighten those down just a little bit and I'll show you what I'm going to do from there. Okay, I've tightened those up a little bit and then I've released. If you look right off the end of my thumb, there's a little bit of an imprint there. I've done that just to mark the shaft because I need to make this shaft just a little bit flat right there uh, so those set screws have a place to go. Okay, now you can see what I've done. I've just made a little bit of a notch in there, and I've done that for both of those set screws. It does not have to be a heavy uh, cut on the shaft. It's just enough to snug those things down. Uh, it does not, uh, you know, there's no real friction there. It's, it's just kind of holding it in. So then we're going to slide this thing on. Okay, here I have it uh, snug down. Now my uh, shaft has a new bearing on it. I've not had to replace the shaft as I would have if I replaced the bushing. Uh, these could be done on uh, blower shafts, uh, HVAC blower shafts mostly. Uh, any type of shaft that I have damage to the shaft where I can't put a bushing on there, I can go ahead and put this on. Now, if this was cut down much farther than this, I think I'd probably have to replace the shaft anyway. But uh, this will ride true, and you've got a repair that you have not had to take the entire blower apart, which sometimes can trash the blower wheel and whatever. So, uh, a fairly quick and easy fix for the failed bearing that has damaged the shaft.